A lot of great first dates come mm. down to one moment, one thing that happens that sets everything else in motion. Whether that's seducing them with a really sexy dance move. Oh. <laughs> going in for that perfectly timed first kiss. Oh, that one's so sweet. Or in Brooke's case, when she wandered over to her husband and muttered a joke about having STIs. No, no, UTIs. Oh. UTIs. Yeah, yeah, oh. urinary tract infection. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, same thing. Yeah, Equally my friend sexy. needed some cranberry juice, you know? Oh, well, yeah. Wow. <laughs> whatever works. <laughs> and for two of our listeners, that special moment came down to one bad Yelp review. Mm. Not only did it set their love story in motion, it led them back here once again for a second date update update. Yay! And we're going to do it right after this. <laughs> we have a return caller on the phone oh. who actually did a second date with us a couple years ago. Wow. Oh, all right. Really? That either means we helped her so much she's been in a long committed relationship this whole time. Oh. Yeah. Or we traumatized her so oh. badly uh -huh. that she's completely <laughs> avoided dating. Until oh, now. Oof. I'm going to go with probably the second. Yeah. yeah. Not. And it was probably mostly Brooke's fault. But her name is Amanda. Yeah. Amanda, <laughs> welcome back to the show. I'm not arguing, Amanda. <laughs> I think I'm a little bit of both. Yeah. Okay. 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 The only thing I remember from the last time is the guy didn't want to go out with you because you wanted to put hot dogs on your salad or something oh, like that. Oh, yeah, hot dog you. salad, girl. Yeah, which is totally <laughs> normal in Brooke's home. I haven't called you Amanda in a long time. <laughs> but I remember you now. That's ancient history, though. We are moving on, and we're happy to have you back. Let's talk about this new guy that you met. Who's he? So... He's the lead singer in a band. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh. Oh. Yeah. oh, boy. A little band, a famous band. Where are we at? I mean, he, they're pretty good, I think. <laughs> Chad good. Kroger, think. isn't it? You saw Nickelback? <laughs> No. Okay. Nickelback would be calling back. Yeah. yeah. That's the thing. Love Wiener Sound. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They're know. desperate oh for fans. Oh, my God. Where did you meet this guy? So, my best friend just got married um, about a month ago. Oh, um, okay. Congrats to them. I met him at the wedding. Well, he was working the wedding, and I was part of oh. the bridal party. So, he was the singer in the wedding band. He was the wedding singer. Oh. Oh, he's so wedding Hopefully he's singer. good then. Yeah. Yeah. I've seen some amazing wedding bands and some not Oh my so god. Good ones. I never thought about that. I bet they get so much action. Am I am I the only one? I keep feeling like Adam Sandler movie. Do you guys remember? Yeah. With it's Drew Barrymore? Classic, yeah. yeah. Movie? It's the a wedding 90s singer. movie. Oh, it's Alexis called, called The Wedding Singer. Yeah, it's yeah. literally called The Wedding Singer. <laughs> Tell us about yeah. how you and, and Chris like connected at the wedding. How did that even happen? Well, I'm just going to be honest. It was a stressful day. And like my friend, she's, she was a little bit of a um, bright chilla. Okay. So I was just like, I'm going to try to get as much fun out of this wedding as I could. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. I don't think you're the first bridesmaid oh. to say that, no. though. No. no, I think that's like the <laughs> mantra. Wow. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> wow. Like, all my money is going to the liquor, and I don't yeah. care. Yeah. There you okay. go. We can get on board with that. So you had some liquid courage going on, it sounds like. I did. And like throughout the time, they were playing songs, and I was dancing, and I think I was dancing like a little bit too much but i was trying not to fangirl without oh. looking like extra desperate okay. Oh, okay so you were like giving them eyes or something you're out there. there i was winking i was winking there is like oh, a winking. middle ground here where you want to show him like you're impressed by his musical skills but not overly impressed where you look I'm like you're sorry. thirsty yeah. i just see a drunk girl winking really hard on the dance floor <laughs> <right now. Yeah. laughs> he thinks you lost a contact yeah. probably yeah. very few times <laughs> panties get thrown on stage at a wedding yeah. event, but take us take yeah, us to the most romantic part of yes. you and, and chris when they had a break i went over and i just like introduced myself mm -hmm. okay so i brought over some chicken skewers i brought over some food to oh. the band and i was like hey do you guys want something to eat oh, oh. that's the nice. way to win over a man give him some food yeah. free food they were like really happy that i did that and so like the whole reception everything was really great and i i danced a little bit too much i'm gonna admit to that how is that a thing can you dance too much at a wedding yeah. because the more people dance the better no yeah. there is a 45 minute dance limit on all weddings. What? If you go over the limit, you have to pay. When they put Shakira on and you think you can barely dance, you dance too much. Oh. Okay. Okay. When did it move to romantic with the singer? 
Well, I wanted to stay over and help clean up. And honestly, I just wanted more time to talk to him. So you helped tear down the wedding? I was helping because it had to be done by a particular amount of time. Yeah. And mm. that gave me more time to talk to him. Oh, that's good. So it was a win-win. Yeah. It's like, hey, do you want to go for a drink after this? And he's like, no, I got to go home, but oh. I wouldn't mind having a drink here. So he wanted to have the drink there with you. Yeah. At least that wasn't like a full rejection. Like he was no. like, sure, let's hang out here. So there's like a bar attached somewhere. Or something. Yeah. Yeah. It was inside. So we just went back in and we were just chatting for like 30 minutes. We exchanged numbers. I had a great time, but mm. <laughs> I tried calling him and I haven't heard back from him. Mm. Yeah. Do you think he read it wrong? Like maybe he's not even single. Yeah. Oh. It's like oh, it's just the girl who brought him food so he's being nice back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can see that. How long has it been since you guys were at that wedding together? Honestly, like a couple of weeks. Ooh, a couple okay. of weeks. Oh, that's, that's a long time. Have you reached out to him? Um, yeah, I texted him and I called him a couple of times, but nothing. So I was oh. like, oh, I don't know. Weird. Okay. So we're going to call Chris for you in just a minute here. We'll try and get you a second date update and you can tell him, I want to grow old with you. Okay. Oh my God. Yeah. She gets the reference. It's from yeah. Wedding Singer. Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh. yeah. It's the that song. Makes it better. Yeah. Okay. Oh. oh. Okay. Now it's all right. All right. I thought you, you were just it. creepy. <laughs> yeah, okay. got same. It, yeah. Uh, Amanda, it's just going to be you and me on our own during this <laughs> one. Maybe. We'll yeah, we can just do the movie punch. Okay, okay. yeah. <laughs> we'll <laughs> quote the movie. Those. Try and get your second date update right after this. Hold on. You're in the middle of a second date update update, and we're going to find out how the couple is doing right after you hear part two. I want to make you smile. Huh. Oh. oh, I love Is this also wedding singer? Oh, yeah, are you getting it now? No. Is this movie even good? I don't remember. Yeah, see, I'm playing so this song funny. from the movie me? The Wedding Singer because my co-host didn't know what I was talking about when I quoted this song. <laughs> I did, Jeff. Not, Is that Adam Sandler That is Adam yeah. Sandler singing oh. it. Huh. But Do you not remember the movie? I don't. <laughs> it's so good. The, I mean, I've seen it. The main reason I'm playing it is because one of our listeners, Amanda, met the lead singer of a wedding band the other day and yeah. was super turned on. Oh, yeah. I know it's hard word. to compete with Adam Sandler rocking a mullet, but Chris, <laughs> who she met and was singing in the band the other day, was even hotter. Oh. That's why she stuck around late after the wedding was done to help clean up just so she could spend more time with him. Yeah, after that night, did. though, no second date has emerged. Mm. Brooke, mm. thoughts, theories, would you like to badger the witness? Yeah. Now is your time. <laughs> I, I mean, did you even ask him if he was single? Yeah, I did. Oh, you did? Uh, okay. Oh, so you know okay, he was. So we well, there know. goes my number one theory. Well, um, what, did, what did he say? <laughs> Yeah, he was. Oh, okay. Oh, that was, that was, good follow-up. It's a good follow-up. You know, yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. You know, he was like, I don't know, maybe. <laughs> if he's then like, we, yeah, I'm a married man. Yeah. So I don't know. Could that be a clue. How do we have to ask? <laughs> this <will be> solved. <laughs> maybe you were more sloppy drunk than you yeah, thought you that's were. that's what I'm thinking. Yeah. yeah. But do you yeah. think as, as the lead singer of a wedding band, he would know that. He's seen that before and would give her some grace. doesn't mean he wants to go out with it on a date. Okay. Well, I'm coming. Oh, she's an it now? Yeah. I'm trying to come in with a positive attitude <laughs> here. Brooke has no interest. So let's just hey. call him and uh, we'll see what he has to say. You ready, Amanda? I'm ready. You oh. got this. All right. Yeah. There it is. Let's do it. Here we go. Hello? Hey, is this Chris? Uh, this is him. Who's this? Hey, Chris. My name is Jeff from a radio show called Brooke and Jeffrey in the Morning. Hey, Chris. You're on the Yo. show with us. Hi. Uh, okay, it's a bit random. Yeah. What can I do for you guys? Sorry, don't worry about my co-host. Oh, you just focus okay. on me. <laughs> it's just you and me right now. Yeah. Uh, we're doing something called a second date update, and we're trying to help one of our listeners who you met the other night at a wedding where you were performing. Do you okay. remember Amanda? One of the things she said that she did was brought some chicken skewers out to you and your band. Mm. She was a yeah, bridesmaid. Yeah. I yeah, I do. I do remember her. Oh, you do. Oh, okay. That's a good sign. Uh -huh. I mean, I yeah. bet you meet so many people with what you do. Yeah, it's pretty clutch getting food delivered to you. I mean, that's pretty cool. Huh? That's the way to Jose's heart. <laughs> I mean, we're it's a wedding band. It happens at every gig, to be honest. Uh, oh, yeah. really? Yeah. They're, re they're required to feed the band. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> that was in the contract. <laughs> okay. Uh, but I mean, food aside, we were hoping to get a sense of what you thought about Amanda. If you liked her at all. Um, 
Yeah, she she was just a very, very, um, like... Uh, Good dancer, is that what you're going to say? She was a lot, she was a lot. <laughs> like a lot she, of dancing. <laughs> uh, yeah, definitely a lot of dancing, that's, that's for sure. Um, yeah. But I think the biggest thing that really, really, like, threw me off is that she left us a review on Yelp. Wait, what? And Wait. And that's good. She didn't tell us this part. Was she just trying to help you out or something? I mean, she obviously thought uh, you were a good singer and also attractive. Yep. Yeah. Hopefully that's not on the review. She's like, uh, five stars. He's so hot. Yeah. I think that would actually bad. be a good yeah. review, actually. I don't think anybody would like actually <laughs> left a three-star review. A three-star? Three out of five? Three stars. And she, like, wrote, oh, the music was really good, but the lead singer never called me. Um, oh. 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 No. That is way too much information. Oh. Like a, it's like a dating review. Oh, no. Yeah, it, it was extremely <laughs> awkward. And, and for me, like... <laughs> That really Aww. crosses the line, yeah. you know, like, yeah. this, this is my business. And Could you see it as a grand romantic gesture, maybe? <laughs> uh, three stars is no. not grand or romantic. I would try every social media, like, DMing on literally every app before that. <laughs> like, okay, wait, though, did, were you planning on calling her back before you saw that Yelp review? I mean, yeah, maybe I was thinking about it, but... I've been busy, so it wasn't a matter of just like, oh, damn, I haven't called it. But then when I saw that review on Yelp, now I just feel like her doing that makes me think, like, what else is she capable of in, oh. in terms of a dating situation? And yeah. I guess that's Can true. I, I mean, ask- what lengths would she go to? Would she, like, call up a radio show oh. and have them call Jeff. you out of the blue? Well, makes we are. so Boy, much Jeff. more uncomfortable. Because that's what's happening. And I feel like she's coming. also on the other line oh. right yep, now wanting to talk to you. I mean, oh my I don't God, know what that says about her. Yeah. yeah. I guess yeah. it's your chance to respond to the review. Oh. But yeah, Amanda is there. Ah, you guys are killing me here. Oh. Amanda? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, are you laughing? laughing. Oh, okay. No. Amanda. You seriously left him a, a negative review? It's not negative. It's not like you totally suck. It wasn't bad. But it's all. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't go to three star restaurants. Yeah. You know, yeah, like no. three Good stars point. is bad. Uh, that's the thing, Amanda. Like you leaving that affects my business. You know, yeah. people are looking to book a wedding band. They they look at reviews. Like, are you are you understanding that, Amanda? No, I, I totally get it. Um, I'm willing to negotiate. Oh, negotiate? negotiate. What, wait, what are you yeah. negotiating? What like... are you talking about? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, like, how badly do you want me to change that review? What? Oh, oh you can take it down. You're going to hold his review ransom now? <laughs> yeah. Is this like black? I don't know. Ransom negotiations. Call it what you are want. Are you trying to be yeah. funny? Okay, so it's like she sounds mail. like she's smiling you're, a lot. What are you saying? You're, if Chris does go out on a date with you, are you willing to take it down or change it to a five star glowing yes. review? Yes. Two dates. Whoa. Two, Two dates. Amanda, that sounds crazy. Okay, if we if we do one date, I'll I'll do four stars. I'll promise that. I keep what? my promises actually. One star oh, per no. date. Oh. <laughs> I mean, you know, I have to. I do admire her uh, her tenacity and roundabout way of uh, getting my attention. What? But uh, are you seriously considering this? Chris? It's his business. He's a business man. Okay, can I totally get points for creativity? Like, give me some here. <laughs> hey, I, hey, I'll give you that. That's for sure. Thank I mean. you. See, he oh. likes her now. God. Actually, if this was Survivor, I think you would probably win. So, um, <laughs> You've gone from the wedding singer well, to Survivor, and they both like that. If anything, <laughs> she could go with you to any of your future wedding gigs and dance Ooh. a lot and hype I you could up. Totally help manage. Just saying, and negotiate. Uh, what is it? I, I wouldn't go that far. I was just gonna have you dance to get the whole <laughs> yeah. crowd into okay. it. But uh, I'm just shocked that Chris is entertaining this idea. Hey, you know, it's, it's a tough world out there. Hang out with me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is going on? Amanda sounds over the moon back there. <laughs> yeah. At least about how this is going. I so, don't know. I think she's already taken it as a yes. Yeah. Yeah. She's something in her coffee. We, we need to officially hear Chris say yes to a second date that we will pay for. Hey, it's one date. Like, I think one day I could probably get you to, to leave a five star. So um, oh. I guess I, I, I would be down. Oh. Hey. <laughs> okay. I'm down. Okay. Yeah. Right. I feel like she's going to trap him into it. marriage. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> Just to save his business. I think that's the plot to a wedding yeah. singer, so <laughs> thanks for spoiling it. Uh, well, congratulations, you two. Yay. You guys got a, a date. Yeah. Very unexpected uh, okay. call. Wow.
<laughs> and Amanda, if you could leave us a review, I feel like no, we, we don't want. No, we yeah. Don't. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, we're called the Ryan Seacrest Show. Go leave <laughs> yeah. a good review. <laughs> Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Guess who's back? Oh my god! Amanda and Chris are here to give us an update. Chris, what? how's the relationship going, man? Actually, you know, um, a lot has changed since going on your guys' show. Oh, oh really? Wait, wait, this is like the Yelp review of what happened. <laughs> yeah. what, what's changed? What does that mean? Uh, yeah, so um, after your show, uh, Amanda and I actually uh, ended up going back out yeah. and um, ended up together. Hey. Nice. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, and, and it's funny because she started coming to some of the weddings that I was performing at. Oh. oh, that's kind of funny. It's kind of weird. Yeah, Bring your you, girlfriend to work day. You don't hear about hey that. Going to oh, work. you are oh, there. You are. I'm how here. Was, how was it going to the weddings with him? <laughs> it's going really well. Like, I was there to be supportive. And, don't lie, to get free cake. I know it. Yeah. <laughs> and free cake and drinks. All about the cake. <laughs> and it was funny. At one wedding, Chris started playing a love song, and halfway through the song, he called me on stage and he told everybody that he's met someone special. What? And Aww. yeah, it was really sweet. Someone else's wedding? Oh, yeah. wait. Wow. Someone else's wedding. Hold on. <laughs> yeah. And everybody was like tearing up. Oh, They're they like, were. oh my God, you guys. I'm sure the bride was crying or yeah. the mother in law was crying. Yeah, because they just paid Chris a bunch <laughs> yeah. of money. Yeah. Yeah. That's an odd move, Chris. It was well, a the love part fest. that Amanda's okay. actually also leaving out is that when she came up on stage and you know, everybody was having a moment she started singing with me oh, and uh, oh a little duet Amanda actually had a pretty good voice so everybody was sort of blown away you and, said she uh, had a good voice yeah she actually has a really good voice oh, wow yeah so now you guys are business partners and more than that well, we are no longer together as a couple but Wait, we are what? still in oh. the uh in the same band oh you guys broke oh. up yeah oh. okay but you still work together but now you're in the band yeah. together i guess that's an awesome thing that came from it we're still yeah like we're on great terms everybody mm -hmm. enjoys amanda and she's been doing a great job in the band so like it, it, i think all in all it worked out Cool. Um, well, I give her a hard time sometimes because I say maybe that she wants to join the band the whole time. That's why. That's why she. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... Maybe. Actually, maybe. it's Amanda's band now. Yeah. yeah. And right. It's like when Fergie came on to the Black Eyed Peas. Nobody cared about them yeah. before her. <laughs> Guys, I'm pulling a no doubt. Just don't tell him. Oh. oh. Okay. Same <laughs> thing. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> well. Move. Glad it has kind of worked out for you too. Yeah. It's, it's not romantically, but professionally. Yeah. Yeah. Keep us updated. It's Brooke and Jeffrey in the morning. Yeah.